It's Maria at Wheels Boutique. Today I'm gonna share with you a very interesting project. I have Will. What's up guys? He has a BMW M2, originally on air suspension. We are going to switch over Will back to a static life and we're gonna put yes. some KW variant 3 suspension on it. Right now we're gonna take it for a drive so that he can test out his new suspension and then we're gonna share with you the other modifications we're gonna be doing to his car. So right now, I got the keys. And we got here Team Anarchy. So those wheels are gonna be looking really nice after we repowder coat them. Centers are gonna get changed up. We're gonna do a complete different look on this car. And when I mean complete different look, we're talking about everything's gonna be different. Even the suspension. Look at this poor guy right here. Been through hell. He'll survive though. He actually looks kinda cool. Can I give you a little idea of what it's gonna look like? Poor front bumper, man. Poor front bumper. So welcome back to Static Life. Yeah, I know, right? It actually looks so good. And it's not even on the real wheels yet. Yeah. It's not even done. And the yellow is gonna pop so good. A lot, way more. I just wanna see the brush silver on it. Save the ocean. That's my speech. Alrighty. I'm excited. Time to test drive the KW Variant 3. So he's going from an air suspension back to static coilovers. Yes. tell me before it was very stiff actually which was mm -hmm. really weird because I like I never expected to be stiff because it's air suspension so you kind of expect like a little cushion mm -hmm. but funny enough like this handles a takeoff and like turns 10,000 times better than air suspension like an air suspension when you're taking a corner mm -hmm. it's very it's kind of it, it gets me nervous sometimes especially when you're going fast because I was scared it would blow out on me because there'd be too much pressure yeah. built up. And that was really like, So for that's me, pretty much what you mean that you felt like the stiffness when oh, you would yeah. turn, but and it was like too hard. This just feels like, when you're taking a turn, it just feels like smooth when you do it. Like you don't have to really like worry about oversteer or understeer. Stage 2 custom tune and it kicks ass. Oh my god. The the ride quality is just insane. Like it's so smooth over it feels like bumps. very smooth. It's so smooth. And like, not bumpy. No, not at all. Like you stay stable in the cabin. Like it's it's like actually insane how big of a difference a coilover makes from like a stock suspension and just like air suspension. Yeah, no. For everyone who wants to do air suspension, I recommend you consider coils before you go that way. Because I've ha I had air suspension my M2 for a year, about a year and a half, and I loved having it aired out and everything. But at the end of the day, the ride is just not the same, and there's a lot more risk, especially when you drive a performance car. You don't want to risk your car like me because unfortunately on the highway about a month and a half ago 
my air suspension blew out on me while I was going about 85 and the bumper fell on me. The bumper was scraping on the highway for about 10 minutes and I couldn't get off because I was in the middle of the highway. That's at like, terrifying. At like 5.45 p.m., of course, in ru like rush hour. Yeah. And that was just like horrible. And I had to deal with like literally hearing it scrape all the way until I could get <laughs> off the highway. It was just, that was horrible. My life is scraping. suspension you did the look that you wanted with it yeah but after time you know you thinking that the air suspension is gonna help you know keep the look on your car because you can raise and lower the car in reality um you're messing up the function of the car for purposes of look and you forget that you're driving a bmw yeah. the ultimate driving machine turns into not being the ultimate driving machine so oh, i guess absolutely. it must be really nice the feeling of having function back to your yeah. vehicle no i like if i could go back in time to where before i ordered my air suspension i would probably get coils just like and a big thing that i think a lot of people don't realize air suspension does not save your front bumper or your front splitters oh, that is no. a, i've experienced that hands-on i've gone through four front carbon splitters on this car with my air suspension on and the, those claims about it like saving everything that's not true because yeah. it's cool to rise your car and drop it but if you really want to drive drive your car you definitely need a set of coils because coils just make god that like the turn is just like smooth now. yeah you're turning like, right now and an air suspension even if you were at the same height of the coils right now you'd probably be having a different like a harder time making that I would turn be, I would be literally like leaning over because yeah. how stiff the ride would be. I'm like, no, this makes a million times difference. It. And you don't really like feel your neck swerving I, to the side like crazy. It just it feels nice. You feel it grip back on and like you're good as like, inside the car. You were taking turns at like 45 miles an hour. Yeah. Like around that little circle mm -hmm. right there, and I did not like have to like I was not worried. I didn't have to press the get like the brake or anything. And like, the stability in your steering wheel was good. Yeah. No, it was it was perfect. Like 
the amount of like ride comfort now is just like actually insane like over a bump any pothole mm-hmm. now like we went over those a bunch of those those like nasty little bumps and like i did not really feel anything yeah like it just felt like i was riding smooth which is insane i can't wait to actually drive it on the highway because i i know it's gonna be like such a nice smooth ride down there oh god this guy is behind us oh god <laughs> Man, no, this is this is very nice awesome i'm super happy amazing. that you like it i knew you were gonna like it I had a feeling. I knew you were gonna like it. I had a feeling. I know I was gonna like it, but I didn't know I was gonna like it like this much. Yeah. Like it's really, really good. It's just now you can really enjoy your car. Park it over there. On the corner here. Yeah. You can really enjoy your car now. Oh, this is insane! The fact that I've been driven in months is just. Oh my god. More seatbelts. No, it's. It's actually like a million times better. The drive, like I know I'm gonna like enjoy the shit out of this. This is just like, this is really good. I'm glad, I'm super yeah. happy that you like it. And we almost went with the other company. Yeah. Thankfully. With the other cheapy coilovers, yeah. just to get rid of the suspension yeah. as soon as possible. But you gotta build the car the right way and you'll really get to enjoy the performance of it, especially on a BMW. You wanna, yeah. This is like the perfect daily for somebody that likes to go fast. Oh, and yeah. If you're ever going to lower your car, don't do springs. Go straight to KW. They will tell you everything you need to know, and they will get you the right suspension package, especially from Wheels Boutique. I've gone here for well more than a year now, probably at least like two. Yeah. And like every single time, everything gets done properly. Everything is done just like perfectly and I at, at the end of the day like I still enjoy it like every single time that something changes it's always good like I always enjoy it and like it just urges me to keep on doing more changes because I just love it that much oh good teamwork yes teamwork makes dream work hell yeah I love when it loses grip in the rear and it's it amazing. goes ah! and you back in but, and like you don't feel like it's not like a bad like it's yeah. so nice when you do it like you feel so comfortable like I did not worry at all when I like when we would accelerate. Like I just like it was so smooth over like any bump. Like it was just really like. And I've been on other cars that have coilovers too, but when they'll take you know 45 degree angle turns at 40, 50 miles an hour, your like your whole body and neck. Oh God, uh, <laughs> your whole body and neck like you feel you feel the turn. Yeah. It whiplashes you. In this case, like, no, you're just there sitting normally in the car, like, almost as if you're not doing that. Was, and we weren't going slow on those turns. No. I wasn't braking at all, and, like, it handled perfectly. Like, I can't wait to actually take it, like, on a track. Yeah. That's going to be it. What we should check out, though, Yes. is Will's bumper. That we, number one, need to fix and put <laughs> new lip and new carbon fiber pieces on it because they were destroyed. So the biggest misconceptions on airless suspensions is that your bumper and your carbon fiber lip is going to be safe. Big no-no. He's the perfect example. It's a lie. It's all a lie. Some people can handle a little life. So here we are. Well, this is the poor bumper that's life was lost. And as you can see, on the bottom, it is just absolutely ruined. Destroyed. Just completely ruined. Got all the rock chips stuck in my clear bra. The carbon fiber is just completely destroyed, flaked away. My grills are disgusting. Just the whole, needs the whole 10 yards. I think we're gonna put a lot of loving into this car. Oh, yeah. Aside from changing him from the air suspension to coilovers, we're also gonna be wrapping the car, so changing the full color of the car. We're gonna be repowder coating the centers of his anarchy, and we're gonna be putting RW carbon fiber pieces on the bumper so this is gonna look really good big change on the wrap i'm not gonna say the color but it's dope yeah i gotta tell you that never never done just like that freaking army in the matte black that has been in the past and i can't wait to see this color it's gonna be insane finish oh, it's gonna wait, be so pretty oh part. they sent me goodies as well how nice oh here we go Here's the new base. Oops. Oh, here's a canner. 
go. We're going to be replacing those nasty carbon fiber canners with some fresh new RW carbon canners on the bumper. It's so nice and clean. Look at that. Look at this difference. Let's see how big of a difference this makes. That's the old one. Completely, you could just see all the rocks that have just consumed that. And now, we got a new one. Perfect. It's gonna look brand new. Can't wait. Okay. Now we're talking. Very nice. That's a real one. It's gonna look great. We're gonna bring this bumper back to life. Brand new carbon fiber pieces. It's gonna look aggressive as hell. Too. Yeah. Very. Okay guys, now we're gonna check out his Anarchy RS2s. I'm gonna show you the finish and the style. So then later you can compare to what is the new finish that we're putting on the wheel. And here are his babies. This is the electric blue finish of Anarchy. First set ever put on M2. I think ever put on, actually. First set of RS2s ever put on a car. In, you know, like the I electric blue with the polished lips and best choice I ever made and I talked directly to John Maria all the whole team Ben everybody and it was this was like huge like project just to get these out like on the social media and like out on websites and like get attention on them and they smashed it and the attention I get with them driving is just insane I mean I get people like coming up like coming up next to my car and like taking videos and taking pictures of just like the wheels and it's just crazy. And the, and the design in the center, the polished lips, the electric blue finish, it's just yeah. eye-catching, completely eye-catching. Just the overall quality is just insane. Like I've hit, I, I beat the crap out of my M2 and I've taken, I've hit nasty bumps on these, like nasty holes and thankfully I haven't curbed one yet, but they hold up perfectly. I haven't had any single problem with them at all. Never, ever changed my mind on them once I ordered them. Yeah, no, they're, these are actually just like really special wheels to me. For they, a while we went back and forth on maybe you getting different set of wheels for this new look that we were going to do, but we ended up deciding that these R2 are just, they're keepers. It's like, I have like an emotional attachment on them, it's insane. I just, I love them too much to get rid of them. Yeah, they're really special. Of course, Toyo R888 R's, run them every day, don't switch off, don't put stock wheels on them when I drive it go through the rain, do whatever I need to do on them. So these are going to get reset, refinished in uh, black satin and from there on let's see how they look on the car. Alright guys, so this is going to complete the first part of our video. Stay tuned for the second part where we're going to show the entire car completed. For now, I think Will enjoyed his ride on coilovers back to Absolutely. static life. The change is insane. I can't wait to actually have it fully completed with the new wrap, new wheels. Everything is going to be just insane. So I can't wait for it. Stay posted.